Hi all, in this video we'll be seeing five ways to clean your Mac. Okay, so the first thing I would say is clear your cache on uh, websites. So when you have a lot of cache data piled up, uh, the RAM processing power reduces and it might slow your Mac down. So, you know, clearing out your cache is a good idea. So the second one is empty your trash uh, you might not you know pay attention to the data that goes to the trash but it actually piles up and it usually goes uh, more than 5 to 10 gb which is a lot of data so keep clearing your ma uh, trash uh, data then and then and if you have duplicate folders or files uh, suppose uh, when you're downloading a file you might uh, you know click on it twice so it actually downloads on your system twice so when you do that on a regular basis you'll have every content as uh, you know two files or you'll have uh, a duplicate file along with uh, the file uh, the original file that you have so that piles up to the storage and uh, it's it's pretty useless so you can delete them and there are applications uh, that are present in your system which you might not be using right now or uh, you know uh, which are uh, not even going to be useful to you so you can uninstall them and uh, you know have only the applications that uh, you use uh, on a regular basis and uh, on system preferences uh, you can go and optimize storage which will uh, actually you know uh, reduce clutter suppose uh, you know before this uh, format i used to have everything spread out in my desktop but uh, uh, when you click on the desktop here and when you group by stacks here uh, you actually get everything grouped by stacks as in uh, under documents i have all the documents uh, that are saved in the desktop if i go to pdf documents i have all the pdfs that are saved in the desktop so i have it like that suppose if i do not use stacks it's spread out like that so it's always better to use stacks which uh, reduces clutter and uh, keeps your mark clean so i hope you found this video useful thank you